I think it's safe to say that one of the things we miss the most about the good old days are concerts and musical gatherings. It's just so therapeutic and it really brings us together. Well, the good news is that these things are slowly coming back into our communities. And what better place to celebrate than the Performing Arts Center at TAM UCC with a well-known band from Austin called Invoke. Please welcome Jim Moore of the university. And uh, we have Zach here from Invoke. Thank you for joining us, guys. Thanks a lot. Thank you. So tell us about some of the challenges you faced, uh, Jim as a venue and Zach as a musical group um, during the pandemic and how eager we are to get back in action. Yeah, I'll, I'll try to keep it brief because it's there's a lot of detail, but uh, we've kind of pivoted to acting in part as a classroom for our music department in many ways because they need a bigger space to operate in. Um, but we're now pivoting back to live performances, which is really our mission, of course. And so uh, a few weeks ago, uh, the Corpus Christi Symphony did smaller scale concerts and now we have Invoke coming in at the end of March, which we're super excited about. And we really appreciate the fact that um, they're from Austin and they've uh, been able to uh, agree, but agree wholeheartedly that this concert needs to happen. Yes, I think we all agree that we're ready for live music. How about yeah. you? especially being in Austin, the music capital of the world, if you ask me. Uh, tell me what it's been like for you guys. I mean, for the last, it's been pretty devastating um, in terms of our opportunities to play for people and get that connection, which I think is so, what we enjoy so much about playing live is being able to see people in, in the seats in front of you and take that energy and make better music with that. Um, we've slowly started to figure out how to do that online. We have a monthly, um, stream series that we've been doing and doing a lot more home recordings and videoing um, but we're really excited to get back and we're really grateful for Corpus Christi for letting us uh, play a concert there. Fantastic well we are looking forward to enjoying and appreciating your music now let's talk about the Ferguson concert that we're looking forward to so we can hear you guys live give us some details. Yeah so we're um, going to be debuting a couple new pieces that we've been working on in quarantine the Downside is that we didn't get to play live, but we spent a lot of time making a whole bunch of new music and we're really excited to share it with you. Um, lots of inspirations from books we've been reading, other artists that we found online, all sorts of great stuff. Great, well, we're looking forward to it. So give us the details on the date and how we can grab tickets to check out the show. Sure, so the concert's Saturday, March the 27th. And so we're starting our online sales on March 1st, um, because again, we wanna keep crowds to a minimum and we want to make sure everyone's safe so we'll do online sales starting march 1st and then our box office will be open the night of at 6 30 p.m the concert's at 7 30 p.m and tickets are 20 dollars, and you'll have assigned seating everything is socially distant and uh we've been very very proactive in how we're doing all of our guidelines in terms of box office and seating and all those things so it's it's been a really great experience that we've as we've started to pivot to live performances fantastic and zach for anyone who wants to get a little sample of you all we got to check out a little bit here during the interview but where can we go to find more of you guys sure our website is www.invokesound.com or you can catch us on Instagram and Facebook. Um, I think our Instagram handle is invoke.sound. Perfect. Well, gentlemen, thank you so much for joining us today. We look forward to supporting music again at the university, especially at the beautiful venue that is the Performing Arts Center. If you're watching and you've never been, add that to your bucket list, make it a point to check out this show in particular and support our Texas artists. Thank you so much for your time today.